Control unit. What is required? 9 volt alkaline battery. Installation. The control unit can operate one or two 9 volt bistable solenoid valves. The connection to the solenoid valves can be made underground or above ground. Connect the green wire to the negative pole of each solenoid valve, common. Connect the white wire to the positive pole of solenoid valve A. Connect the brown wire to the positive pole of solenoid valve B. Connection to rain sensor. The control unit can be connected to the rain sensor. When the level of water inside the rain sensor rises above 5 mm, the watering program will be suspended automatically and then resumed once the rainwater in the cup has evaporated. Break the connection between the yellow and grey wires, cutting their joined ends. Connect the yellow and grey wires with those of the rain sensor. Warning. If the rain sensor is not used, make certain that the yellow and grey wires are joined together, restoring the connection if required. Fitting the battery. Unscrew the transparent cover and remove the control unit. Unscrew the cap of the battery housing. Connect the battery, observing the correct polarity, and replace it inside the housing. Retighten the cap, checking that the seal is positioned correctly in its seat. Reposition the control unit as indicated and refit the transparent cover, checking that the seal is correctly seated in its groove. Important: Be sure to replace the battery at the beginning of each season. When fitting the battery, the display lights up for 4 seconds. The solenoid valve closes and the timer clock will be set automatically to 0000. Setting the current time. Pressing the button Enter, the message OK will appear. Set the current time using the forward or back key buttons, for example, 9 o'clock. Press Enter to confirm the setting. The control unit can be removed easily from the valve box for better comfort when programming. Daily programming. The control unit operates two independent lines, A and B, and is programmed using just three buttons, with the aid of a wide display. The programs are numbered from 1 to 6. Programs 1, 3 and 5 are dedicated to line A. Programs 2, 4 and 6 are dedicated to line B. Press forward to view the start time at which the valve opens for program 1. Press enter to change the time displayed. Use the forward and back key buttons to set the start time open, for example 10.26 hours. Press enter to confirm the setting. Press forward to view the closing time of the valve for program 1. Press Enter to change the time displayed. Use the forward and back key buttons to set the required closing time. Close, for example, 10.35 hours. Press Enter to confirm the setting. If programs 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 are to be set, repeat the procedure described above. Warning. 
programs can be added only in numerical and chronological increasing order. If changes are to be made, programs cannot overlap. Weekly programming. Press forward repeatedly until the weekly programming page is displayed. Press enter to make changes to the page. Number 1 is associated with the current day of the week on which the first watering program is to be set. If the current day is Thursday, for example, then 1 equals Thursday, 2 equals Friday, etc. Using the forward and back key buttons, position the cursor on the day of the week you wish to select. Press Enter to deactivate or reactivate watering for the selected day. The relative number disappears from the display. For example, 2 Friday, 4 Sunday and 6 Tuesday. To quit weekly programming, position the cursor under Exit and press Enter. Manual function. Press the Forward key button to display the manual watering page for line A. Press Enter to activate the function. Pressing Back, Valve A opens, and pressing Forward, the valve closes. This function is useful for watering plants when required, without deleting the programs already stored. In any case, the valve will close automatically after 5 minutes. To quit the manual function before five minutes have elapsed, press Enter. To open or close the valve for line B, follow the same procedure. View programs. To display the stored programs, press Forward. Deleting programs. To delete a program, press Forward until the display shows the closed page for the program to be removed. For example, Program 3 and Program 2. Press Enter, then press Forward and Back simultaneously. Clabber, the masters of water www.clabber.com